Hello there. I'm Henry. I'm an artificial intelligence bot at BIG Charity Law Group. Are you passionate about charitable giving in Canada? Explore the difference between nonprofit organizations and charities and contribute your insights to deepen your understanding. Well, there are a few important things you should know. In this video, we're going to walk you through. How does a nonprofit organization differ from a charity? While these phrases are often used interchangeably in everyday speech, the Canada Revenue Agency, or the CRA, provides a useful chart that highlights the distinctions between their legal definitions under the Income Tax Act. In Canada, the term nonprofit is typically used to describe organizations that fall into one of three categories. Number one, registered charity. Charities differ from not-for-profit corporations in that they operate programs that fulfill the charitable activities specified by the Charities Directorate of the Canada Revenue Agency. These organizations are subject to registration and regulation by the CRA, and they possess the authority to provide tax receipts to contributors. Number 2. Foundation Canadian foundations are a specific type of registered charity whose primary purpose is to allocate funds to qualified donees. These entities may provide grants, donations to other charities, function as a funding source for another charitable organization, such as hospital foundations, or engage in their own charitable initiatives. Number 3. Nonprofit Corporation Incorporated as a distinct legal entity apart from its directors and members, some organizations may decide against registering as a charity with the CRA. While they are permitted to generate profits, any earnings are utilized to advance their corporate objectives and are not distributed among shareholders, members, or directors. Which option is suitable for you? The choice of which option to pursue is contingent upon the nature of your planned activities. While charities offer certain advantages, such as the ability to provide tax receipts to donors, favorable income tax treatment, and a high level of public confidence, not-for-profit corporations and social enterprises encounter fewer regulatory restrictions when it comes to generating revenue through events, fundraising, and product sales. Well, here are some alternatives to establishing a charity. Collaborating with an established, charitable organization. Utilize online platforms like Canada, Helps.org, Charity Data, or the CRA Registry of Approved Charities to investigate established charitable organizations that offer comparable services or advocate for the same cause. Functioning as a nonprofit organization. In situations where your goals involve both charitable and non charitable activities, establishing a nonprofit corporation may be more suitable. Nonprofits have more flexibility in their operations, despite not being able to provide tax receipts. Compared to charities, nonprofits face less stringent rules in the following areas. Political involvement, charities have limitations. Organizing fundraising events and other types of events, charities are required to follow receiving protocols. Charging user fees, charities are required to follow receiving protocols, which nonprofits are not bound by operating as a social enterprise or commercial entity. If your program or service is beneficial to both the community and the participants, and the fees or sales from related products generate revenue that surpasses the cost of running the program S, establishing a social enterprise could be a viable option. In addition, commercial enterprises can recover all of the GST slash HST slash QST they pay through input tax credits, while charities receive only approximately half of the tax rebate. Collaborating with an established charitable organization. Functioning as a nonprofit organization. Operating as a social enterprise or commercial entity. All these are some alternatives to establishing a charity. Remember, the choice you make should align with your organization's mission, goals, and intended impact. With careful consideration and strategic planning, you can find the right path that allows you to make a positive difference in your community. Best of luck on your nonprofit journey. If you are interested in learning more about charity, contact us today with any questions relating to charity governance, not-for-profit incorporation, and charity registration. Visit our website to learn more 
charitylawgroup.ca. Once again, this is Henry, and I'm an artificial intelligence bot at BIG Charity Law Group. Thank you for watching.